Hello, this is Dr. J back with some more Let's Play Advance Wars 1 and 2 Reboot Camp Blind. We have been going through the Orange Star Advance Wars 2 Challenge missions. And next up is going to be Mission 5, Sea for All. Our opponent is Hawk. We are controlling Andy. Black Hole Air Patrols have slowed troop reinforcements. Can Andy destroy all air and naval units to retake the skies? Well, let's find out. A letter from the enemy. Andy, are you going to fall for this? Oh, Andy. Such a clown. Did you send this challenge letter, did you, Hawk? I am Hawk, a black hole CEO. I can't tell if that was supposed to be sinister or seductive. Get, get out of here, Hawk, you creeper. Hawk, are you as dumb as Andy? Yes. <laughs> Why, thanks. What flattery. Oh, Andy. Hawk, this just keeps getting more awkward sounding. Meet me in combat, and you will learn. <laughs> if you're selling, then I'm buying. There is a uh, saying in Japanese, selling a fight. Which, I don't know if maybe that is uh, sort of where that bit of dialogue came from. We use only air and naval units. And the first to lose every unit loses the battle. It, it, it's Eagle all over again. Hawk, are you just a fight otaku as well? I thought you were more serious than this. Just defeat all enemy troops. Obviously that condition doesn't apply when neither side has any troops yet. So capturing is not an option because we have no infantry and no factories to build them. This is a case where going first might actually be a disadvantage because if Hawk went first, I'd be able to see what he built and build appropriate units to counter it. This is such a weird mission. It's very strange. I guess one option is to just build nothing on my first turn and save up the money and see what Hawk makes. The first few notes of Hawk's Steam are still amazing. And then it sort of degrades and it doesn't become a bad song, but it does not live up to the promise of those first few notes, which are so cool. Okay, a bomber. Interesting choice. Did he build a submarine? I'm not sure, but he might have done. In which case, I'll need cruisers to deal with those. That's a fighter, not a bomber. Oh my god. <sighs> there are some units I just confuse all the time. All the time. And that is certainly one of them. I'm all ripped up. Hyper repair. 
There's not really a good reason for it. The fighters have the swept forward wings and the bombers have swept back wings and look bulkier, so... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why I have that particular confusion. Also, I forgot to turn animations on. And I tend to confuse black hole cruisers and battleships too, but I think that's a cruiser. Yes. Okay, I was afraid that would be the case, but can I block for it? Yeah, I can. Perfect. Trying to decide what to build. Maybe another fighter? Because he'll surely build more air units. Okay, that is a fighter. That is not a bomber. I'm not going to make that mistake twice. Why those things have range? I'm very amused by the revelation that Hawk is just a big fight otaku. It's all these bird named COs Eagle, Hawk. I guess Drake isn't much of a fight otaku, but it's sort of ambiguous whether he's named for a duck or Sir Francis Drake. Could be either. I'm going to need to build something that can kill his cruiser. I have literally nothing that can right now. Now let's get his fighter. And his cruiser might shoot our fighter down, but uh... Let's go sub hunting. I don't know if he's even built any, but. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Shoot this down. You fool. It still makes zero sense to me that it uses its cannon and not its missiles to shoot down aircraft. Oh wow, my fighter survived. Color me surprised. Fairly even exchange when the choppers have first strike advantage. Oh, Hawk has nearly charged his super. And he built another fighter. Or you can run back to there. No, that's not a good idea, because the... Uh, is there anywhere the cruiser can't hit you? Yes, right here. Well, whatever I want to build next, I think I'm going to have to save up for it, no matter what it is. Unless I built a battle copter, but... Battle copters honestly don't feel like a great purchase to me on this mission. can't really do too much with that power this turn, Hawk, so I'm not too worried. 
Black Storm. So I guess he will damage my units, which is a bummer. Oh, right. A bomber was in range of that, wasn't it? Hey, it survived! I can't believe it survived. Lucky me. Now there is a black hole bomber. Honestly, not that easily confused with a fighter, so I don't know why I make that mistake so much. Actually, hang on. Um... Nope. Missed by one. Here we go. Alright, you guys repair. This is such a weird mission. So if I move into these shoals, I'll be out of the bomber's range. Or... I can just move to here and also damage the fighter. Not by a lot, but every little bit helps. <laughs> Andy looks so happy when he uh, is doing well in a fight. He and Max have the most wholesome <laughs> battle reactions. Not all of Max's are. Sometimes he looks a little, uh, a little deranged, but uh, depends depends on exactly which expression it is. I would build another fighter if not for this fellow. Guess I'll save my money this turn. Yeah, I think I will. Oh, I didn't reckon on that. Probably should have. This could take a while. I'm sure I've made some silly mistakes already. Alright, let's expedite repairs, shall we? Time for a tune -up. Hyper upgrade! Go for the sure kill, I suppose. And finish off his bomber. I already have two fighters. I might want to replace my bomber. Or I could get yet another fighter, which will be good for chasing that down. It's kind of a lot of fighters, but taking absolute control of the air doesn't seem like a bad idea. Though I will, I will be needing something that can attack C units to finish off his cruiser. So there's that. That's another fighter. Let's get this cruiser to where anywhere his fighter goes to the south, I should be able to attack it. Let's keep our planes out of range of this. And out of range of his fighter. We don't want to give it first strike advantage. This looks safe right here.
Excellent. I might want to move this fighter over in this direction so that I can preemptively attack things that he builds out of his airports over here. And yeah, I'm going to need something that can attack that. Interesting. Alright, just hover here and preemptively shoot down anything he tries to build. How many airports are there over here? Two, I think. You go head off this chopper. You guys can shoot down this fighter. I have nearly absolute control of the air, I think. Control of the sea is what I lack. I'll save up for a battleship. Alright, let's park our bomber just out of range of the cruiser. Man, fighters are fast. There we go. We have pretty good coverage of the air now. Running out of fuel is our only major concern. Are you prepared? Oh, you're using your uh, Black Way. regular CO power and now saving up for the super, eh? Interesting. Why so impatient, Hawk? Well, let's get first strike advantage. Man, this could take a while since we have to deal 100% losses to the enemy. And you know what? On that note... Let's speed things up a bit. Mm. There, it'll be harder to escape a battleship, I reckon. Let's prevent him from building anything on this airport. That would be one way to mess him up, is to just park stuff on his factories. I kind of like that idea. Doing a little dance between the cruiser and the bomber there. My absolute control of the air is faltering a little. I can fix anything. Hyper repair. Guess he didn't build any subs, which is good, because that would be very annoying. Very annoying to deal with. Hmm, the shoals might work to my advantage. 
because they slow down his cruiser, but they don't slow down my bomber. Well, his cruiser's going for that fighter. There. Hmm. Okay. Oh, his cruiser is going to run out of fuel and sink. Okay, good, good. Park on these airports. There. Shut down that production. Can't quite get there. But it'll run out of fuel running away from me eventually. Of course, my fighters will eventually run out of fuel and uh, crash on his airports. Right, he won't run out of fuel if he goes back to port. I'll just get in his grill, be all disrespectful. And that'll let my bomber get closer as well. I think it can get to here. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. I don't think I need another fighter or anything. get a sub, but I wonder if that would provoke him into building subs, which would be the worst. I wonder if he's programmed not to build subs because the devs realized how annoying that would be. A battle where you have to take out all the enemy units, having to find submerged subs would really kind of suck. A, la a lander. Hawk, my, my respect for your capabilities as a CO just took a serious hit. A lander, really. In a mission where you can't build land units. Okay. That's your choice. You can do that. <laughs> that really feels like an AI glitch there. There is no possible reason to do that. Come on, Hawk, it's clearly over. Give up. Black Wave. This is pointless. You delay your inevitable defeat. That's all. And now his lander is running away. How dare you do that? Cruiser, dead. Uh-oh, fighter's running out of fuel. Then he'll be able to build stuff out of there. Could I have a switch places with the bomber? Chase down that lander, men. Cut it off from both sides. Let's try to get a naval unit in that other port so he can't build anything there either. Wish I could build an air-to-air -air refueling airplane. That, too many airs. You know, a fuel plane. Sadly, that's not a thing in this game. We'll see if he runs out of fuel before he gets home. Hopefully not. You can't escape. Hmm. That'll do. 
And you can't escape by going around this way either. He's trying though, look at him try. It's not gonna work. All right, no matter which way you go, you're doomed. It just does not matter. What is the dead zone on this? Only a single space. So if we move here, we can't get inside its dead zone. Okay, fueling up. Oh great, now that guy's running low on fuel. Some attack choppers might be useful just to park over his airports. Because I don't think they go through fuel as fast, if I'm correct about that. Which I might not be. Nice try, but the bomber will get ya. Okay, we did it. While flying over his headquarters. What a weird mission. Hmm. Quite imp Well, at least you're a man of your word. Except when you betray and backstab your, your leader. But aside from that, at least you're a man of your word. Oh, yeah. Was this whole thing a diversion to draw Andy away? Oh, Andy, you're so easily played. I, I should have uh, known better than to think Hawk was, was dumb enough for these shenanigans. a B, but I'll take it. About 492? Something like that. Oh, or exactly that. Look at me go. It's my easy mental arithmetic. Hey there. Oh wow, more collectibles. Good grief. How is it that I have not unlocked everything possible at this point? Oh, I guess unlocking the challenge campaign, or I mean not unlocking, uh, playing the challenge campaign missions unlocks even more stuff in his shop. Which makes sense. Okay, looks like we've got just two more missions to go. Mission 6, POW Rescue, and then whatever Mission 8 is called. So, Mission 6 is coming up next. I'll see you then.